Hello, my name is Ray Buckland. I'm from Bjorn3D.com. Today we're going to be testing Fessor 1 cooling fluid. The stuff's green in color and it's also non-conductive. We're going to see if it's non-conductive today. See if it upholds it. Uh, earlier today I had a leak with it so I had to put it in this to make sure. As you can see, the fluid's inside of there. Um, we're going to be torturing a fan controller. It's an older one. Not really care if it works or not. I know it does, but who cares? Fan with the uh, LEDs in there, so we can see if the fan's running or not. We got power supply, just an old 500 water. Um, we're going to continue on here. We're going to dunk this in there, and then we're going to power it up. Before we start, we are going to hook it up. Prior to, so we know it is working. Make sure everything works just fine. Oops, oh, and a pair of tweezers. The gentleman on the camera is my friend Danny. He's a Brit. <laughs> also known as the dark and desolate one. As you can tell, everything's running just fine. There's no problems there, fans or butts about it. I don't want to plug it, turn it off. Before we continue, we need to make a sacrifice offering to the gods of overclocking. All hail gods of overclocking. All hail gods of overclocking. All hail gods of overclocking. Okay, we're done with that bit. Gonna take a little fan controller here. We got our water here, non-conductive. We're just gonna drop that in there. As we can tell, there is it in there. We're going to grab our little uh, fan controller here and my little paper towel. The sacrifice is accepted. Now, there's water everywhere here, so what we're going to do, we're going to take the power, hook up the power to it. We're hooked up there with my fan. Plug up the fan. I think they've been biting me lately. And. You're going to jump pin 14 to a ground, which is usually designated by a green wire on the power supply. Now, we have, ouch, damn it. <laughs> Stay. Now, we're never satisfied just dunking in is not enough. We need to add water to things. Well, we're just going to pour the Fessor 1 fluid over the fan controller while it's still hooked up. I think my radiator sprung a leak. Take our finger, now we're really going to make sure. Ah! Nope, just kidding. Didn't zap me or anything. It's perfectly safe. Wipe my fingers off. As you can tell, it is running. We're going to turn off the lights here. Um, you want to turn that switch off so you can actually see that it is still running. But in complete and total whiteness. So you can tell the fan control is still working. The water is non-conductive. And it works just fine. So for those of you who are looking for water cooling for the computers and afraid of the water torching their computers, Sissies. the Fessor 1 cooling fluid will keep you from torching your computer components if you happen to spring a leak. Um, we're going to call it a day right here, so you all have a nice day.